Too many thoughts on my mind. I can't sleep at night, so I just keep writing. I don't need no help. I don't need opinions, so don't wait for Yo, 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 what is going on, guys? It's your boy, Burgers Kicks here again today. And, you know, before I start this video, I would just want to give a huge, huge thank you to each and every one of you. We passed the 1K sub milestone, you know. Wouldn't be possible without you guys. It means so much to me. Thank you guys so much. So, yeah, let's keep it going, yo. Let's keep, keep the subs going, bro. You know, mine as well, right? But, yeah, no, on a serious note, thank you guys so much. It means so much to me. Um, when I started making YouTube videos, I just started doing it for, you know, fun. Never thought I'd actually get anywhere, but you guys proved me wrong, and I hold that very close to my heart. So, yeah, just wanted to say that before we got into this video. Um, as you can see from the title of this video, um, I'm doing a top five bots on each site, or each platform, I should say, of, like, Shopify, Foot Sites, Supreme. I might put it in all, like, an AIO in, even though, you know, basically covers all those sites anyways so the first one I'm gonna get into is Shopify as we all know almost every single bot supports Shopify there's very little or very few bots that don't um, obviously Shopify is sites like Kith DSM concepts sites like that undefeated um, Shopify is obviously it's like a way of the, how the website's set up in a way of payment processing in a way like how you can go through checkout um, I would say my top five bots on Shopify currently which is early August 2020 would have to be cybers I'm, I'm not gonna put them really in order I guess because a lot of them most Shopify is like really really good like if they hit they hit um, I might I might order them out so I would say cyber Cyber AO, obviously you guys know that. Belco has been doing very well on Shopify lately. Raft, obviously, Raft has been destroying. Um, Project Destroyer actually has been doing some. I mean, they might be like a number six. They haven't been like absolutely crushing, but they've been hitting on decent releases. Um, NSB as well also hits on Shopify drops. Um, NSB for its price point does very well on Shopify, considering you know it's an always in stock bot and it's only 500 bucks. And then probably the last bot to do well on Shopify would be Kodai. Kodai does pretty decent on Shopify as well. Um, it's been crushing foot sites, but it's also been doing very well on Shopify as well on other sites. So yeah, that those are mainly it for my personal opinion on Shopify bots that are currently in August 2020. Um, obviously, you know, you can disagree with me. You can have other suggestions. If I missed one, let me know because there's so many bots out there. I'm, I'm bound to miss one. Um, so yeah, let's move into foot sites. Personally, I love foot site bots because... They're usually a lot of stock. They're fairly easy to hit on, and you don't have to worry about like shitty Shopify drops. Like most foot sites, you can hit on and stuff like that. So obviously, you know, Cyber on that list again. Cyber does amazing on foot sites. We're gonna put Kodai on that list again. Kodai has been destroying foot sites. You know, it's going fucking berserk, boys. Um, wish I had my own Kodai copy, but I'm too poor. So, um, Project Destroyer also crushes on foot sites and um soul aio actually has been doing very well they just added foot sites and on their beta testing they they absolutely destroyed and yeah so i would say probably the last bot that destroys foot sites well not last but on my little list would be probably ganesh if you have if you get good proxies Ganesh just destroys. Um, it just it it does way better than most other bots, and I know people who've hit hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of pitch. Um, so yeah, those are the five that I would say on on foot sites. Obviously, there's many more foot site bots that are very good, like Toru, Phantom, um, Balco has been doing okay on foot sites. Rush, Rush just recently added foot sites and their beta seem to destroy as well 
Um, but in my personal opinion, those are it. Oh, and you know, I forgot. Like I said, you know, I would Wrath. Wrath does very well on foot sites as well. I'm gonna add that into the list as well. So we might have we might have six for foot sites because you know, fuck it, why not? Burger can never do anything right, can we? Um, so yeah, those are those are the bots I say that are good on foot sites. Like I said, most most bots that support foot sites usually hit because they're not hard to hit on. But obviously, you want bots that are gonna be able to destroy because obviously that's what the whole point is. Um. NSB does well, I know, like I said, I'm forgetting bots, but there's just so many, because, like, literally, almost every single bot supports foot sites, and they usually, like I said, they usually hit, so it's not really, I'm trying to base it on, like, which bots have the most, like, success and cooks, which I should have put Wrath up there more, because, whatever, I just don't have Wrath, so I don't think about it as much, it sucks, you know, Jason, you can slide in my DMs, they're open, sauce me a Wrath copy, you know, I'm just kidding, guys, I'm kidding. Don't actually do that because I don't want to be handed things. You gotta, you gotta earn things in this community, boys. You don't want anything handed to you. Um, and then uh, the next category I'm gonna talk about is Supreme. Obviously, I don't know if some people may not know what Supreme is. If you're watching this video, Supreme is just like its own site. It's its own thing. It's has no connection to Shopify or foot sites or anything like that. It's just its own subcategory of Supreme. That's all it is. Um, like I said, most bots will support Supreme. There's a lot of them as well. Um, the one I would say that's hitting probably the hardest or hit the hardest last season would definitely be Mech Prime. Mech Prime absolutely destroyed. I don't think it plopped on any single drop. Maybe one drop the whole season. Um, yeah, it, abs it destroyed the drops. Um, I would probably say second after that, Velux does very well, if that's how you say it. Velux, Velux, how the fuck you say it. Um, they did very well as for most of the season as well. Um, and then I would go into probably Cyber. Cyber did fairly well in Supreme. They had some issues with like payment failed and stuff like that. But you know, hopefully Lucas can fix all that stuff, which I'm pretty sure he did. So I would say when Cyber is like working and they got it going, like they're probably up there like top tier, probably one or two. Um, next, I would probably say would be, I mean, personally for me, like on restocks, Project Destroyer does very well on restocks. Um, every time I've ran restocks on Project Destroyer, I've hit. It just, it's one of those bots that it does very well on restocks. Doesn't usually get caught up in things. And then the last one I'll include on this little Supreme list would probably be Kodai. Kodai, obviously, it's an all-in-one bot, so it has Supreme. And they hit pretty pretty well last season as well. They, I don't think there was many drops where they flopped. I know a lot of their users cop the workbench when it released. Which was obviously a super limited and super hype drop. So obviously if they have users copping, shows the bots good. And then the last little category I'm going to include is uh, Yeezy Supply and Adidas. Most bots will only support Yeezy Supply, but there's a couple who do Adidas as well. Um, personally, for me, there's like a bunch of bots who support them. There's two of them that stand out to me. Well, obviously Polaris, number one. Polaris with their bypass just absolutely destroys Yeezy Supply. Basically, if you have Polaris and you run it, you're going to hit. Um, I would say second on that list with recent additions of their new capture solver could be Splash Force. Splash Force does very well now that their uh, little V3 bypass has been enabled. They, they absolutely destroy. And I would say Phantom and PD are close behind. They are both very well... Um, Phantom also has a V3 bypass. I imagine if PD adds something along those lines, it'll, it'll cook even harder. And then, um, the last one would be Soul AIO. Soul has been destroying Yeezy Supply releases and stuff like that. Yeezy Supply and Adidas. Um, yeah, and it's been, it's been doing very well on these drops. Which obviously, you know, leads to huge success and stuff like that. Um, I imagine I'm missing some. Kodai, yeah, Kodai does okay on Yeezy Supply. But, I mean, I imagine I'm missing some. Um, Wrath, oh, Wrath does very well as, uh, as well. Like I said, guys, I told you I'd miss some. 
there's just so many bots like and when you don't own a bot it's you forget about it sometimes so yeah bear with me you know give me the benefit of the doubt so um yeah that's basically it that's my little list for august 2020 um, you know you can disagree with me you can drop suggestions tell me what i missed in the comments because i know i definitely missed stuff or put stuff in the wrong spot um but yeah hope you guys enjoyed the video once again thank you guys for 1k subs that means so much to me so yeah like i love you guys let's keep going boys we're going to the fucking top so yeah burger out boys see ya